This is Nancy Fahm reporting from the second day of a vast in hearings at the FDA in Silver Spring, Maryland. Yesterday started with a series of testimonies by advocates who were for or against keeping Avastin on the market for breast cancer treatment. FDA officials also made their statement yesterday and stood by their position on withdrawal of the drug's approval. Today, it's Genentech's turn to defend their position and after a series of questions, the advisory committee will vote on it. We spoke to one physician who's attending the hearing to get his perspective. I think this hearing and the discussion we're having is critically important, understanding the issues surrounding Avastin. It's not just Avastin. There will be other drugs as well where these questions are going to come up. And we as a matter of public policy need to address those questions and come to the best possible conclusions. The, the information may not be new, but how it's packaged and how it's presented, how it's discussed and how it's considered is very important. We need to have these questions uh, resolved or discussed, shall we say, in an open public forum. We need the right decision on behalf of patients. Uh, and frankly, I think that although this is the first time this has ever happened, I do believe that this is critically important and will help us move forward as we ask the questions about what is a safe and effective cancer treatment. Check back with us throughout the day for more updated information. This is Nancy Fahm.